Did this go off? Catch the live earlier? Did you guys catch the live earlier? We had a great little live earlier, y'all. Man, you know. We had a great little live earlier. Oh, nice. All right, let's get it, y'all. We had a great little live earlier. I'm glad, um... I went live earlier because y'all seen what the sun was doing. Okay. What happened? The sun is in Uganda. Who? In Uganda. Who's it? Let me see. Wait, who said that? Who said the sun is the sun is here, bro? Uganda. A large. Let me see. A large only got 49 followers. I don't think he can go live. I don't think he can. Nah, because in order to request, you have to have a, you have to have a thousand. You have to have a thousand. Um. But what's going on, y'all? Peace, peace. What's going on? So what's it called? So we had a great we had a great live earlier, y'all. We had a great live earlier where I was basically showing what was going on with the sun. Um, they're obviously getting ready for tomorrow. Uh, well, today now. Um, but did you guys? I just dropped a video in regards to a dude talking about. Um, him and his partner was walking. No, they were going somewhere, and they saw this lady um, outside staring at the moon, and she was just basically staring at the moon, and she was like waving back and forth. And then when she stared at them, she looked at them and had that smile. She had that that Steven Spielberg smile or that smile that um, it gives you. It the clown. You know what I'm talking about. Um, yeah, yeah, kind of like the same, kind of like the same smile that uh, the Grinch does as well. Honestly, um, but 
Let me play the video, y'all. It's better for me to play the video for y'all. Because if we can go into context, more context into this. Oh, yeah, the ancestors are here. The ancestors are here. Bro, y'all won't believe it. Okay. Let me play the video for y'all. Let me play the video for y'all. Bro, y'all appreciate love that. Thank you for the paper crane. Thank you for the paper plane. Appreciate love that. Yes, let's get it. Let's get it. Send more gifts. Angela, appreciate love that. Let's go. We're going to restart this. We're going to restart this. Check this out. Today is April 4th. This happened around 2, 3 a.m. Literally, bro. Me and my homeboy, we got done hooping from the gym outside, y'all. This was Carlton, Plano, Frisco area, around the area, y'all. So if y'all live around the area, please be careful. We were hooping outside. We go to Quick Trip at night. Er anytime, in the morning time, middle time, at night, we go there and get our snacks and our drinks after we get done hooping to go home. So, boom, as we park, because everybody parked, no, the parking lot is empty. It's in the morning, like early. The parking lot empty. The sky is clear. It's only a moon showing, bro. As we walked inside there, bro, as we walking up inside the bro, I promise you, it was a lady in the middle of the parking lot. When I told you this lady, eyes was pure black on my soul. Like, she's got, bro, her eyes was black on my mama. You see the white parts on my eyes, her eyes was black. Like, bro, when I tell you, me and my homeboy looked at her, bro, like, she was, in, she was just like this. I promise you, like, looking at the sky like this. Like, bro, I, pr I promise you, bro. And then I promise you. Man, y'all gonna think this is not kept. This is not trying to be funny. It's not no skit. None of that, bro. I'm telling y'all. Me and my two homeboys. If you know me personally, just add me, bro. I, you will know the two homeboys I've been around every single day. Bro, when I tell you, this was this is exactly what she did, bro. She said. They started smiling. I promise you, bro. Like, But her, man, bro. Her smile went all the way up. Bro, man, y'all gonna think I'm kept, bro. You see, he's talking about the smile, okay? He's talking about the smile, like the, the smile that just went quick. Kind of like what Joker was talking about in Batman as well. Um, and this brought me this brought me right back to this this over here. OK, because as soon as I saw that, I was like, hold on. It brought me to this. Let me see. This right here, this right here. Prior to the storm, Hurricane Michael, we <laughs> had asked, you know, so, hey, there's a new horror movie coming out next week. It's called Smile. And you may... So, hey, there's a new horror movie coming out next week. It's called Smile. And you may have seen the commercials. Looks kind of creepy. And you may have also seen this if you were watching baseball <laughs> so, games over the weekend. Smile, right? Do you see what she's doing? Now, do you see what kind of smile she's doing? Does that look like a very happy smile? Right? It looks like some type of possession in a sense, right? It looks like some type of possession in a sense. Could be whatever, you know. Uh, it, uh, you, it's your discretion, okay? Your discretion. I'm just giving you my thought, all right? Now, I want you to see this, okay? All right. I want you to see this, all right? Just, just a smile, all right? Now, and then she is also wearing what, which was called... <laughs> She's watching. also wearing like a yellowish shirt, right? Like a highlighted yellow. Y'all see that? She's wearing like a highlight a highlighted yellow shirt. Okay. Now, the reason why I say this is let's let's continue watching. Let's continue watching. Baseball games over the weekend. <laughs> Paramount apparently paid for actors to sit behind home plate at big league golf ballparks <laughs> with a big creepy smile on their face the whole time. And they got a lot of camera time because you know they're right behind home plate. Some viewers took to Twitter asking what the heck was going on and it soon became pretty apparent.
parent. It was some good old flash, uh, old fashioned viral marketing for the movie. So, Katie, uh, you like this idea? I like it. I think it's creative. And look, they're getting two, three minutes of free airtime right now on Fox Five talking about this movie. I don't. Hold on. Did y'all hear that? I think it's creative. And look, they're getting for the movie. So, Katie, uh, you like this idea? I like. Did you hear that? He called her name Cicadia. And we're supposed to have cicadas rise tomorrow, right? We're supposed to have cica trillions of cicadas rise tomorrow during the solar eclipse. What are the odds of that? This was. I think it's creative. My people, this was a year ago. A year ago. Circadia. Talking about that movie Smile, right? Talking about that movie Smile. And then it goes right back to that. That dude making, talking about he sees people smiling, right? Looking at the, the moon and smiling. Now check this out. Now I go further. I go further. <clears throat> I look. When did Smile come out? Okay, look. You can't make this shit up, right? Hold on. We are we are in the year of the eight. <coughs> Excuse me. We are in the year of the eight. Okay. And I look, when did Smile come out, right? Right? And then we are in the year in the eight, and we are in the fourth month, which four is half of eight, okay? Half of eight. Now, I put, when did Smile come out? Look, September 30th. But do you see when it first premiered? Smile premiered at the Fantastic Fest on, look, September 22, which is eight. Look, two, 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 which is eight. Do you guys see that? Y'all see that? It came out on eight. Now, in America, in the United States, it came out on the thirtieth, which three is half of eight. If you cut down an eight down in the middle, it gives you a three. Do you see that? Now, September, sep, really means seven. Okay, Seth, they, they, they tell you it's the ninth month, but it is actually the seven months. Seth means seven, right? Seth means to sever, 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 sever ties, right? And then that's why it's sept, and then it gives you the three, because the sept just cut the eight in half, and it gives you three. Y'all see that? September. That's why when, that's why when they cut word, they'd be like, timber. Y'all see that? Because it just cut that wood in half. And it's falling down timber. So now, but y'all see that. It gives you an eight in the year of the eight. And the smile was contagious in the movie, right? And now, and then now, okay, so now, eight, eight, eight. There we go. The budget was 17 million, which one plus seven is eight. Now. Let's go to this. Where is it at? There's so much going on in the world right now, y'all. There's so much going on in the world right now. Look at this. Look at this. In 2024, look at the numbers. Eight, right? 22, eight. One plus three is four, which is half of eight. Okay? The cicadas. All right? And then you have, will Koei merge with the 17-year-old brood, which is eight. Okay? Which literally is eight. Now, everything is adding up to the number eight. Okay? Now, it's funny because I showed I showed earlier in my live how the even the sun looking like an eight. Even the sun looking like an eight. You guys see that. So even the sun's looking like an eight. So 
And you know what that's about, right? Because, <laughs> hold on. And, and this is why they say, why is six afraid of seven? Because I always wanted to know that joke. Why is six afraid of seven? Because seven, eight, nine. Look, I'm about to show y'all. Fuck, God damn. Wow, I apologize, but wow, look. So why is six afraid of seven? Because, look. Nine. Nine either. Because we're getting swallowed up by the black hole, which is ten. The DNA. Exit. Do you guys see that? Why was six afraid of seven? Because seven is what's coming to tie. Seven is coming to sever. It's coming to cut. That's why the Grim Reaper has a scythe. Seven and then eight also is eating, swallowing up, right? The black hole, right? Because the black hole is magnetic. We are magnetic beings. We're going to be swallowed up through the black hole. And then we are nine ether beings. And this also relates to completion because nine is the number of complete. Do y'all see that? Oh my God, bro. Bro, are y'all kidding me? Have you seen a movie called Code 8? It's about people getting their power. There's so many movies out there like that right now. Um, But check this out, right? Because when I put... Look. When I put... When I put... Look, when I put smile... <laughs> look at this. When I put smile... Smile. Again, the movie Smile. Dang it. Where is it at? Where is it at? The movie Smile, Right? The movie Smile, it gives me, look, 16, okay? Uh-oh. You see? Cicadas give me 16. Y'all see that? And then we're having trillions of cicadas giving you 16, right? And then, one again, 1 plus 6 is 7. So the cicadas... The cicadas is the set. It's the seven. It's what's severing us from this dimension because they are vibrate. They speak in vibrations, in tones, in frequency. Like I said earlier, right? We are vibration. We speak in tones, vibrations, and frequency. All right. So the cicadas are set or are, are sixteen. Now, when you look at sixteen, you have sulfur. Sulfur, you see that again. Soul is full. The soul is full. And if you look at the symbol, the alchemical symbol is above. It's above, telling you to look up. Telling you to look up. This is why they made the movie "Don't Look Up," <laughs> which they're really, which they're really and they're really telling you to look up. You see that? They made the movie "Don't Look Up." Meaning to tell you to look up because when you look at the alchemical symbol of of hearing things in the sky, even me, even me, man, there's like a huge rumbling. There's like huge rumbling going on in the atmosphere, in the ethers, man. Things are moving. Things are moving. So now when we go to look, when we go to sulfur, right, we see a C again, 16, 1 plus 6 is 7, 32. Again, that, this, this is evolved, right? All right. Now let's just out. Let's see. Again, fire brimstone. This is why we see meteors, meteors or comets or whatever falling from the skies right now. Everywhere, especially in Arizona, it's happening. But let's see. Look. Look at this. Appearance. Check this out. Appearance. There are several allotropes of sulfur. The most common appears as yellow crystals or powder. Yellow crystals or powder. Hmm. Interesting. Hold on. Hold on. What color is that lady's shirt? 
wouldn't that be like a yellow crystal? Like a yellow is green as crystal? Hmm? Look at that. Huh? A yellow. This is sulfur or what they call. What's that? What's that? Pollen. <laughs> Do you guys see that? <laughs> Do you see how her shirt mirrors what they're talking about here? Huh? The yellow crystal. Hmm? Right? Which is the pollen. Right? Now check this out. It's funny. Let me see. Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Check this out. Sulfur is used in the vulcanization of black rubber. Now, we are known as the rubber people. The Olmex. If you ever heard about that. We are known as the rubber people. So, the vulcanization of rubber. Activating rubber. You see that? In a fungicide black powder, which is the black goo. The black goo as a fungicide and in black powder. Most sulfur is used in, in the production of sulfuric acid. I was looking for something else in here. Let me see it. Where is it at? Mm. Is it is in here? Okay. All right. Now, let's go. Now, check this out. Okay. So, now we see that, right? Now we see that. Yeah, this this is what what an amazing time to be alive, right? Now, how how can right? So you have game. Look at the score of the game. Huh? It's glitching. All right. Um. All right. If it's glitching, look. If you look at the even the dates, I mean the look at the score. The score is three zero, three zero. Right? Who are they playing? Who's in New York? Is that New York? I can't even. What is that? I mean, I don't. I don't know what team this is, but this is the A's again. The A is the first level of the alphabet. That's why you're seeing A's in the sky right now. All right. But at the but when you when you come in when you even go in and you look at the movie. Right? Look. It came out. You see? 3 0. On the 30th. On the 30th. And then you have 30th here. And then you have 30 here. Y'all see that? On the 30th. And then you have 30 here. Now, it's funny because. The reason why, the reason why they are smiling, right? <laughs> the reason why they are smiling, right? Is because you smile when you have to look up, right? When, you, when you're looking up at something, when, 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 when someone's about to take a picture, they tell you to look cheese. That's when you smile. You smile when someone's about to take a picture and it tells you to look up, smile. So they're telling you to look up and smile and say cheese because it's about to be a grand solar flash. <laughs> Y'all see that? There's about to be a grand solar flash. And they don't want us to see that. Could that be the reason why? Because I even showed how they're like coming in front of the sun earlier and just spraying up the sky. Spraying up the sky. Right? You only look up at the sky in awe. And then the sun is about to go through a grand solar flash. And that's why you smile. Say cheese. Hmm? <laughs> Say cheese. And this is why, this is why mouses, this is why mouses, this is why mouse, right? This is why mice, right? They love cheese because mice are really the mice high. The most high. <laughs> you see that? The mouse high, the most high. <laughs> Look at that. That's why mice love cheese. A slice of cheese, which is cheese, peas, right? And what goes on? And what goes on? On what cheese? What does cheese go on? Pizza. Pizza. Peace. You see, like pizza. Peace. A pizza. Pizza. That's why cheese and pizza go together. Y'all love cheese pizza. Well, the people who do love cheese, you feel me? 
Yeah, look at look at look look at Tom laughing. Mm -hmm. Look at Tom. He got he, he got the cat on there. He got the cat emoji. That's Tom laughing. But <clears throat> so when so when they show when they when they when they said who did this, they said they said this is Paramount. So Paramount staged these actors, right? Again, we are all we are all actors. Where did that go? Wow, that's where did it go? I lost it. Again, we are all actors because we are all acting upon our toroids. Actor, actor. We are all acting upon our toroid by our toroid. Our toroid, it is. It's our heart. It's our torus field. It's our heart. The toroidal field. The ever flowing, ever self sufficient, self feeding, self everlasting. Um, where is this at? Okay. Oh, but look. So it's Paramount, right? And Paramount make movies. Okay. Paramount make movies. Okay. Paramount make movies. Now, do you see? What Paramount equals? Paramount equals 38. 38. 38, which would be the three eights. We've been talking about the eights. 38, which is the three eights. It's been eight all long. It's been eight all along, right? It's been eight all along. So again, this is a this is a, this is this is the planet. This is the planet doing a hold on. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We got the same BD. I have a question. BD. That's not my, that's not my birthday. Oh, you can ask your question. Um, what was it? You can ask the question. Wow. Watching <laughs> baseball games. But what, what, what threw, what really threw me off was he called the girl, uh, what's it called? Circadia. <laughs> he called the girl Circadia, right? And then there's there's cicadas that are emerging, you know, tomorrow during the solar eclipse in order to help with the frequency, okay? Because that's what that's what um, solar eclipse. That I mean, that's what cicadas do. In fact, I even told y'all that the sirens sirens get get their um their noise from the cicadas technical jerk so it's a warning it's a warning y'all see that now now don't what's it called when when a cop be behind you don't they be making that noise that that get out the way right that right not the siren but it's like a it's like a it's like a frequency pitch that they that they put out it's like a frequency the pitch that they put out it's it's like a it's like a rude awakening type of sound you guys see y'all know what i'm talking about right you know I know y'all. I know y'all got pulled up by police before. Don't even cap. Don't y'all y'all not be lying. Y'all don't even lie. Mm? I know y'all got pulled over by the police before where they hit that hit y'all with that little buzzer tone. It's like a buzzer tone. You feel me? Yes, it's like a buzzer tone thing. Like like a yeah. So imagine a trillion of that going through. Imagine a trillion of that going through, right? Listen. Every 17 years, these guys come out of the ground and make it almost impossible to go outside. It's just deafening. 
Listen to the noise this one makes. It sounds like something out of Star Trek. Jesus. That's what one of them sounds like. And here's what thousands of them sound like in a concert. Imagine, imagine what is that going to do, you feel me? Imagine what that will do to the frequency of the planet, okay? I'm looping. I'm looping, and I have perfect, man. And I have perfect, I have perfect, um... Okay, man, I don't know, man. Should you go in and go out? Okay, I'm a, I'm a reset, y'all. Bro, this was it. yes. It is a matrix. It's literally it's 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 a matrix. That's how I'm a, that's how I'm able to break things down like that, y'all. It's literally a game. <laughs> it's literally a game. What if the sound makes people combust like human? And I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you this. I'm gonna tell you this. It's gonna make a lot of things. It's gonna make a lot of things. Okay. It's gonna do a lot of things because the solar eclipse, the solar eclipse. Because you gotta understand, there's been a lot of things a lot of particles chemicals all this stuff spray in the atmosphere that's why they've been talking about going to war okay the sun is the progenitor of life it is the creator of life so if the sun is changing you are changing and the sun is about to emit this frequency out there okay so it is an upgrade frequency it's an upgrade frequency and these people are fighting against it because they know they cannot go to the upgrade they cannot go to the upgrade because if they go they they first of all they can't live in that in that in that higher vibration and then not to mention if they go up in that type of vibration they lose all kinds of um you know leaderships and you know positions to be able to manipulate us to hide in the man it's frozen again all right and someone's saying it's frozen All right, y'all. I think I'm just gonna. I think I'm just gonna. I think I'm just gonna go. You good? I'm good. All right. All right. Bet. All right. Um. So, see, they they got me off track. So, what was I saying? Um. The vibrations, the frequency of vibration. What would, uh, in particular, in particular? Yo, what's going on, son? Traveler, peace. The energy, son, about the yes. All right, so yes. Um, so, man. Now, in my live earlier, I said what cicadas represent. Okay. All right. Now check this out. Now, if you ever, now, 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 check this out. This is in the movie The Flash. Thank you, appreciate love that. Thank you, Heart Rob. Thank you, who's that? Gratitude, right? Check this out. All right. Yeah, I was saying they can't go. Yeah, they can't go because again, they lose power. They lose everything. Not to mention they can't exist there. They can't exist. Okay. Um, because the the if you look at the reptilian brain, the reptilian brain is it's the it's it's the bottom part of the brain. It's the that's why it's the it's the it's the subconscious part of the brain, the lower part of the lowest part of the brain. That's why they live underground. You get what I'm saying? As above, so below. As above, so below. So the the reptilian part is the lowest part of the brain. So reptilians live underground, right? And then because they live underground, they manipulate us from the underground perspective, right? Because they control everything from the underground, right? They have their henchmen over here. Either they're manipulating them and 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 unconsciously projecting their awareness to them, or their consciousness to them, or just body snatching them and then doing these things. All right. So now, um, now, when it comes to um, cicada, right? I told you when you break down the word cicada, right? So sick, sick, right? I said this before, the earth was sick. So in order to help the earth, what do you do? You send aid. So it's sick aid. 
right? Cicada, cicada. So she's helping, the cicadas are helping earth vibrate into a new frequency because that's what they do. They make noise, they make vibrations, okay? They rattle, they shake shit up, okay? So they're, they're aiding her in raising her vibration, okay? Sick aid, seek aid, sick aid, okay? Now, now let's look at the flash, okay? Um, I just put this up. I haven't seen this yet, but I want to show y'all about the flash because they, they put these in, the, in these movies and the TV show. They always tell us the truth, but I want to see what they say over here. Hold on. I said, how does Cicada get its powers? All right, let's continue. Ooh. Okay, you got me. Third ice cream of the day, you know. Something fishy's going on here. Bro, you can't make this shit up. You can't even make this shit up. Look. Something fishy's going on here. Hold on. Something fishy's going on here. Third ice cream of the day, you know. Something fishy's going on here. Third eye scream. Because it's third eye scream. Do you see that? Third eye scream. Because it's the three suns. When you see these three eyes, <laughs> right? When you look at the sun, the giant sun in the sky looks like a third eye. And you see that, you scream. Ah! Right? <laughs> Wait, isn't that the truth? Right? You see the giant eye in the sky because it looks like it looks like it's got two eyes. And then you see the third eye posted and then you scream third eye scream. Right. And then she said something fishy is going on here because I just say I was just saying in my life earlier how we are fish. This dude keeps saying that we are that I'm frozen, man. Seven phones. I was. All right. And I was just saying in my life earlier that we are fish. Remember, right? Jesus was a fisher of men. He came to teach us how to fish. He came to teach people how to fish. Not to mention, Jesus represents the Piscean Age. He is the fish. He represents the fish. Now we are leaving the Piscean Age and, and entering the age of Aquarius. That's why she said, I scream, right? You see the three sons, something fishy going on here because we're leaving the Piscean Age, right? Something fishy going on here because the fish is going on the fish is moving on <laughs> you see bro you can't you fucking make this shit up let's continue let's continue now watch this okay you got me listen we're celebrating because this we're celebrating is a very special day you hear that one year ago today i made you a promise and I would turn my life around and make things better for you. I can honestly say that my life oh is my around and make things Listen. better for you. Listen. And I would turn my life around and make things better for you. Listen. One year ago today, I made you a promise. Bro. One year ago. So, hey, one year ago, and then I just showed you the video with the dude calling this girl Circadia a year ago. Do you guys see that? Hold on. Listen. Viewers took to Twitter asking what the heck was going on, and it soon became pretty apparent it was some good old uh, old fashioned viral marketing for the movie. Circadia, you like this idea? You hear that? Circadia. Do you like this idea? And then a year ago, Cicada gets his powers. Are you kidding me? And he says a year ago. Today. One year ago today. Wow. Promise. One year ago. Let's go. Turn my life around and make things better for you. I'm going to show you how things are connected. I can honestly say that my life is a million times better than what it was. And it's all because of you, Gracie. So I got you something. Now, we're gonna we're gonna show you. It's the set I wanted. I thought your little doll house could use a family. Now, did y'all hear her name? I already have one. 
Did y'all hear her name, I though? You, kiddo. Did you guys hear her name? Purple. You know, I think four ice creams in a day would be the... Look at the sky. Look at the sky. Look at the sky. Do you see this? Now look what happened to the people. Look what happened to the people. Look. Look at that. Gracie, thank you, Legion, because that's this is very important. See? Shit coming out of the sky, right? Now he gets hit with a shrapnel. Right in his chest, okay? Understand that. He gets hit with a shrapnel in his chest, okay? Your chest is your heart, okay? It's your heart chakra. Now, right now, look at this. Look at this. The screams in the day would... You heard her? No, I... I love you. You heard her? Purple. She looked at the sky and said purple. Tell me why a few days ago I posted a video about purple skies in 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 seattle hmm tell me why a few days ago i posted purple skies in seattle washington hold on hold on where is it at come on come on tiktok come on tiktok come on tiktok come on tiktok where is it at yeah tiktok be hating look anything positive anything positive I, I post this video about us getting powers, about us getting powers. And look, I get a community's guideline violation for it. I, yo, my people, my people, I post a video about us getting powers, receiving powers. Right. And TikTok gave me a, 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 a community guidelines about it. Right. It was going up. It was going viral. And they snatched that shit. They were like, nope. It says hatred, raise, uh, uh, we are all equal, one, one. I was like, shut the hell up, man. Shut the hell up. But, all right, but, but check this out. Um, where's it at? Look, Seattle, why? look, look at this shit. You cannot deny there's something here, y'all. Look how pieces. I apologize, y'all. But look, purple, purple. You probably see it as like reddish, but, but this is literally purple. This is purple. Y'all see that? Look at the young guys. They happy as hell. But purple. You see that? And so what happened is after they see the purple skies, what happened? They start to they start to die out. They start to they start to pass out. Screams in the day would be that. Right? Now you see, do you see in his name is Cicada? Cicada, and we're supposed to have cicadas tomorrow. Tomorrow we're supposed to have cicadas, and then we've been having purple skies everywhere. I just posted the sky being reddish purple in Chicago the other day, and then someone sent me another video of Chicago sky being red yesterday. I just didn't get to post it again. Y'all see what's going on? There's a lot going on in the atmosphere. The energy is dense. It's intense. I'm tired. I can't go to sleep. Bro. My body's up. And cicada. Wow. Um, you see? So, cicadas with an S. Appreciate love that, uh, Debbie. Gratitude. Thank you very much. I love my content, too. You know, that's why I make it. You feel me? Um... <laughs> but uh but listen this is why what's it called um cicadas right i'm gonna show you 
So when you put, when you put, when you put cicadas, right? When you put cicadas, right? Cicada gives you 13. Okay, but when you add an S, it gives you 16. Okay, it gives you 16, right? Oh my goodness. Wow, 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 wow. So it gives you 16, okay? Now, the reason why that's important because 16, because 13 gives you soul. It gives you soul, okay? Now, my people, what color would you think soul is? Hmm? I've been having downloads about the cicadas. Let's get it, sharing it. If I tell you picture what color soul is, soul is, what color soul is? What, what, what would you say? Like a bright greenish yellow? No. Yes, Debbie. Yeah, green. Yes, Nanita. Yes, like a bright greenish yellow and, uh, and all that. Again, again. Right? Tell me why her shirt is. <laughs> Tell me why her shirt is this. Again, because we are about to be smiling. Hmm? We about to be activated as well. Because this is a double-edged sword. It's a double entendre. Everything, every action has a reaction. That's the only way to put it. And then you can't even make this shit up. I even have a fucking yellow. Look at this. What are, what are the odds my drill being out here, bro? I did not set this shit up. <laughs> bro, are you kidding? What are the odds my drill being out here and it's the same color as this lady's shirt? Bro. Yo, bro. Are you kidding me? Okay, um, so now, all right, now, the reason why, preach a little that, uh, who's me, who's that, preach a little that, thank you for the heart me, thank you very much, your mask color, <laughs> now, the re now, cicada gives you 13, which is, which is soul, okay, now, an anagram, right, an anagram for soul is lost is lost okay now anybody anybody dragon ball z fans here anybody dragon ball z fans here anybody dragon ball z fans here i'm sure a lot of it i'm sure a lot of it yeah the green do right appreciate love that appreciate love that not either all right can anybody explain all right, Dragon Ball Z fan. Can anybody say how do one go Super Saiyan? How do they achieve Super Saiyan? How do Saiyans achieve Super Saiyan? How how do they become Super Saiyan? No. What do they? What what usually happens? When, when, the, and, and, uh, and turn of them, um, uh, turning Super Saiyan. Spine, rage, not rage. I'm looking for a specific word. Come on, y'all talking about Dragon Ball Z fans here. Y'all don't even know about a Sun Charger. No, y'all need to go watch Dragon Ball Z again. Y'all need to go watch <laughs> Dragon Ball Z for real. Trauma. Close, Hustle King. Close. But what is it? What is it? chakra explode no come on it's something it's it's when you when you it's something that happens to everybody like when you when you watch something like you're like oh man where did it go his past life no almost close close his past life close mm, no how do you turn super saiyan like when you see someone when you see someone oh Oh my God! Regret, down. almost close. No, no, no. Heart chakra. No. How do you turn super saiyan? What activates a super saiyan within you? Trigger. When you get triggered. Hmm. Yes, yeah, trigger. But what? 
emotions but what what is it okay Family. what is the anagram for soul how do you get what is the anagram for soul what is an anagram for soul what is soul backwards lost yes by using the power of lost remember when goku first went super saiyan who did he lose krillin remember that right krillin he lost krillin when mm -hmm. gohan first went super saiyan what did he do he visualized the power of lost that's how he turned super saiyan right which is an anagram for soul you see that lost is soul soul is lost so you gain a soul by losing by losing what hmm? yes and we've been losing so this is the build up <laughs> That's why the big eight ball is coming to deal now. It's not the little son anymore. It's the big eight ball that's coming to deal karma now. The you see that? The, the eight, eight, yes, the eight ball is the eclipse. That's why the sun is looking like the eight now, right now. The eight ball is the sun with the eclipse. That's why I said, yeah, bro, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'll carry you, man. I'm telling y'all, yeah, man. Um, but what was I going to say? So, yes, you use the power of loss in order to achieve Super Saiyan. And loss is soul. And you see the color of soul, right? The soul glow is this yellow etheric aura that's around you. And then you see the lady wearing that yellow etheric green shirt. <laughs> y'all see that? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Appreciate love that. Sonia, gratitude. Gratitude to you so much. Gratitude. <laughs> um, but, yeah, man, that's just so crazy. That's just so crazy. So now, this it's happening in April, okay? When you break down the word April, it's, it's the real. The real. Or you know that's why that's why we have our our our, our men called Daryl or Daryl or Darrell, right? And it's funny because I had Sorrel today, so Sorrel, which is so real, and we so yeah. We saw a Darrell store. In di a Darrell store. It was like Darrell something. Darrell something, and then the lady I saw the pendant to her name was Mur Morel. Oh wow. Morel, are you kidding me, bro? So the um, <clears throat> what was I saying? The Sorrel, the Darrell. Morel, oh my god, um, so much L. Uh, what was I saying? What was I saying, babe? I just blanked out a long day. Yeah, she, uh, you see what I'm <laughs> we saying, had a long bro? Day. We had a long day, y'all. We've been up since I've been up since like I was like five o'clock, tossing and turning throughout the bed, and then we worked this long event. It's been a long day, um, but uh, should we stay high? Um, what did you say? Should we stay inside tomorrow? Because they're saying we should stay inside. Listen, I keep telling people, people keep asking me the same thing over and over again. You do what you want. You do what you want to. I'm going to be outside. I'm going to be outside. Most likely, the sun's going to be covered up anyways because they because there is something here. There is something big here. There is something big here that is on the glass and is going to cause big shifts. Okay. I showed y'all in movies what's like what they project to be happening. These movies are messages, y'all. I literally be telling y'all. Hmm? I literally be telling y'all, I be literally be showing y'all the movies and I be connecting the dots. I literally be connecting the dots and showing y'all. And these movies be literally telling y'all what's going on. Okay. What's what's happening is we are being clean. Right? We are being clean, we are being conditioned, we are being primed in order to ascend. Right. And that's why 
<laughs> That's why it's called Washington, D.C. That's why it's called Washington, D.C. Because it's we are being washed. Right? Washing 10. Because 10 is the DNA. Right? Washing 10. D.C. So who's washing 10? Who's washing 10? The government is Washington because we are 10. We are the DNA. We are the gene code, the DNA, the 10 it means DNA. So wash the, the, the government is Washington. So they're they're You get what I'm saying? They're brainwashing us. They're brainwashing us because they are washing 10. The government. Y'all see that? They're washing 10. They're washing our DNA, whitewashing everything. Lying about everything, removing us, you know, uh, taking our noses off uh, our statues, right? Okay, hiding, our, hiding everything. Washington, white Washington, man, that's crazy, man. Ooh, that's crazy. And this is that's that's literally the reason why. Look, you can't make this shit up, bro. Is li this literally the reason why? Look at that. Huh? <laughs> Washington no, D.C. is literally the drum of the washing machine, and it's also the knob too. You see that? Is the knob where you eh, eh, eh. the niggas wa they washing us, y'all? Huh? Y'all yeah, see that? And then, and then look. This is the needle on the knob. You see that? It's the needle on the knob. <laughs> you can't make this shit up, bro. Bro, you can't make this shit up. You can't make this shit up. Wow. Wow. I just make it up? Yeah, just like you make everything. Uh, you don't belong here. Um, yeah. Okay, y'all. Uh, um, <laughs> bro, you two away. Um, this is what's coming. But you have no idea. This is the type of intelligence that's coming back to the planet now. This is the, this is the type of intelligence. This is how you know what I'm saying. Think about this. Imagine having this type of conversation with people all the time, having these stimulating conversations. No more going back to, yo, did you see what P. Diddy, you see what's going on with P. Diddy and Meek Mill? Oh, oh, oh. I heard them niggas behind the closed doors. I heard that, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness, y'all. Did you see LeBron James put up 50 points? 50 points, he just beat Jordan. Oh my goodness. <laughs> how does that, how does that sound? How does that, how does that sound good? What about that sounds good? What about that sound enticing? What, what? I don't understand that. Now, it's, it, I don't even hear people talking about sports anymore. I don't hear people talking about none of that anymore. Back in the day, like in 2015, 2014, people were always like, are you going to go watch the Super Bowl? Maybe I don't even, it's because I don't even resonate in that type of information. Maybe that's why. But yeah. Um, but you see what I'm saying? This is the type of knowledge wisdom intelligence that's coming to the surface now what's up baby yes, i was witnessing orb of light soaring in the sky in tennessee yes. uh, and yes. i and then and, and then look again 10 you see mm -hmm. 10, 10 i see, see. <laughs> 10 i see that's why everything is happening in tennessee right now that's why if you pay attention when you're driving down the road the license plate you're gonna see the most is tennessee because it's 10 I see. Everything is about 10 right now. It's the exit. It's the DNA. It's the exit. It's the DNA. That's what's happening. I guarantee you. See plates. I guarantee you. I guarantee you specifically on the highway. Okay? That's where CERN is at. CERN is everywhere. CERN, I, I, I broke. I'm not. I already talked about what, what CERN is. CERN is literally the sun. Um, but check this out, right? 
speaking of CERN, right? Speaking of CERN. My baby and... Speaking of CERN, right? <laughs> Do you see the app, uh, the layout of CERN? Do you see the look at look at the layout of CERN? Look at that. Just look at that. Now, doesn't it look like someone looking down? Hmm? Doesn't it look like someone looking down? Right? An eye looking down. But it's an eye regardless. Okay? So that is CERN. So that is the small hole going inside of the big hole. Okay, that's a small hole going inside the big hole, right? Now, um, hold on. See, this is why it's called Atlas. I'm literally telling you at last. You see that? At last. Okay, Large Hydron Collider because. It's a large hydron collider because they are colliding. This is what we call the great convergence. You see that? Large hydron collider. Hydrogen, this, which, is, which is hydrogen. Remember, the sun is nothing but a ball of hydrogen. Large hydron collider. Do you see that? Which is planet X. That's what planet X is. That's what it's all about. Okay? So now, this is the layout of CERN. So why does, hold on, why does the layout of CERN look like the orbit? Do you see that? Why does the layout of CERN look like the orbit? Hold on. Hold on. Why does it look like the size of planet X and Earth together? You guys see that? Hold on. Y'all see that, right? You see that? Which is literally, again, it's a camera flash. It's a, cam it's a camera flash. When you take a picture, right? It's the eye. It's the eye. It's the eye of the camera, okay? <clears throat> now, I still got to do that. Like, now, even if you look at the... if When you look at the... um. When you look at, see, when you look at the orbit, when you look at the orbit, that's literally what it is. It's literally, that's what it is. It's literally what it is. That's the orbit. It's just a long loop. You're just looking at it from another angle, a, a 2D perspective. We're just looking at it from a 2D perspective. But that's literally what this is right here. Hold on, let me remove this. This right here is this. It's the orbit. You see? Here's that right here. This small one, go this Here's this small one, and here's the long one. We're just looking at it from another angle. Y'all see that, right? <laughs> Do you see that? Do you guys see what I'm saying, right? Because the reason why I say that because that's why CERN is turning on because we're about to go through the hole, right? Because if you look at Damn, that shit went super viral. I put CERN, I put CERN Fermilab layout. It shows my video. That bitch is super viral. Hey. That junk is super viral. But if you look at CERN...
Hold on. Look, I, I can't even, I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. Look. Yo. Hmm. And it tells me how many views I got. But look. Um. Fermilab. Fermilab. Layout. If you look at the Fermilab layout, it's an eight. Mm. Do you see that? It's an eight. So it literally is, it literally is, you see, it literally, it's an eight. It literally is the small going into the big. It's the, it's the, it's the, it's the, it's this, is these two beams right here about to collide. Y'all see that? Is dude is these two beings right here about to collide? This is why they turned on as well, right? And the finished product of it is this. <laughs> Do you see why they're together? Do you guys see that? It went from separate, separate to one. Y'all see that? Do you guys see that? Do you guys see that? I'm sure y'all see that. That's why CERNs are kicking off. Because we're going back to this is the great convergence. Right? Again, this is why CERN gives you 15. Which is exit. Y'all see that? Because we're about to exit. That's why it went from this to this. This is the crack in the firmament. That's why it says north area, right? We're heading north and it's saying com compass, which is compass. Compass, come on through. Y'all see that? Oh my goodness. Bro, are you kidding me? Come past, come on through. At last. They're waiting. Yeah, man. Huh? Too much up, too much uploads, man. Too much uploads, too much downloads, man. I feel so much, man. I feel so much. Uh, the energy is so high. I, I think I not think I'm getting ready to call it an evening, y'all. I'm ready. To, I'm getting ready to call it an evening. <laughs>
So planet Earth is terraforming, okay? It's terraforming. That's why all these things are happening. And then you have these cicadas coming up to change the vibration, the frequency, uh, the, the vibration of the Earth. It's like a cleansing process, okay? Because you have higher dimensional beings coming here in order to come here, in order to be able to walk on this planet. So it has to be cleansed. Again, it has to be cleansed. So you have the eclipse coming to cut old energies, right? The eclipse is coming to cut old energies. That's what eclipse does. Eclipse, eclipping, e energy, clips, and then you have, um, and then you have, uh, um, what's it called? Um, yeah, the green comet. The green. Oh yeah, the green. Yeah, and it's funny because the green comet, right? And the lady had the green shirt. The lady had the green shirt. You see that? The lady had the green shirt. So, you have. The eclipse coming to remove, cut off old energies, and then you have the black sun that's putting out new energies out there, new energies, new frequencies, okay? And then the people who are connected to that. So I tell y'all, y'all better go out there, get in that soil, get in that, get your feet in that soil, and get these uploads. You're gonna get them regardless, but get in that soil, go out there. Hey, schools closed, workers closed, all that shit is closed, so you might as well eat it up, soak it up. But um, <sighs> but all I know is after tomorrow, things. If all I know is I don't know, we don't know, we don't know the day or the time, but we know there is intensity coming. There is a lot of things coming on the planet. Okay. But yeah, yeah, I'm done, y'all. I'm calling the evening. I'm done. We don't need no special glasses. I told you, we don't need no special glasses. The reason why they're blocking out the light, the sun, is because I told y'all the sun right the sun is consciousness right the sun is consciousness the sun is the is the the sum of our consciousness it is our light source it's a higher self amalgamated into one light being one huge light being so now you have other suns behind there you get me right you have other suns behind there that's coming to basically rain judgment upon the planet Okay. These are the black sun. You have the blue kachina and the red kachina. So this is putting out different entities, different spirits, different souls into the ether. Remember those videos of those people that you see in Thailand and Japan and and they're looking at something and they're spreading around and they're dying and they they were on being unalived, right? This is this is a situation that's going to be happening or people going to be stuck. These are entities that are coming here, y'all. That's why they're trying to block out the sun because they don't want nothing coming through the sun. The sun is a portal. The sun is a portal. I hope you know that. The sun, the sun is no different to planet Earth. The sun is no different to planet Earth. Because in a way, planet Earth would be classified as a sun. Planet Earth would be classified as a blue sun. A blue sun. That's what planet Earth would be classified as a blue sun. So when you're looking at the sun, the, the sun has beings living on it. Just because they're not showing you the, the, what the true sun looks like, what is really out there, the sun has beings living on it. Yeah. Okay, just like Earth. Earth has beings living on it too. You and I live on Earth. Okay, so when those alignment happen, the great convergence is this is going to send out energies from all those planes. And I told you, you have a lot of angry ancestors that are coming back for vengeance. A lot of angry ancestors coming back for vengeance. Y'all have no idea. Y'all have no idea. And that's why people are staying home that's why the the military is being called that's why CERN is being called to activate that's why all this stuff is happening because 
they don't know what's going on. This energy has been brewing for a very long time. You have a lot of angry ancestors. And they're not in spirit. They are not in physical form. They are in spiritual form. Y'all been seeing this. Y'all been seeing that they had. There's a TV show on Netflix. It's an age. It's a Korean. It's a Korean TV show. Someone posted it the other day. It's a Korean TV show, where they show people are being judged, and then out of nowhere these beings manifest and start destroying people. Bird box, you know, zombies, all this stuff. You're really about to see this world for what it really is. You're really about to see that there are only a real few people, a, a real few people, a real few people in this world. I've been telling y'all that. Everybody else is just vessels, empty dead vessels, empty dead shells, organic portals for people to walk in through. They're not real. They're just part of the matrix. And you're going to find out. It's going to. It's. You're going to be like, what? I thought that person was real. Nah. It's going to be a lot of interesting. That's all I'm saying. Those movies, those movies are speaking. They're telling you a message. Those movies and those TV shows come out for a reason. Just because you don't see your face in there, just because you don't see your family's face in there, your friend's face in there, does not mean it's not speaking to you. It does not mean it's not telling you something. There's a message in it. Just like, just like when, just like the, just like, let me give you an example. Just like the assassination um, of JFK. Let's say, for example, when the, when, when JFK got assassinated, right? And people thought it was Lee Harvey Oswald. Then people thought it was this guy. And then that, that. And then it finally came out that the, it was the CIA that did it, right? Well, Right. People had it in the back of their mind that the CIA did it, but they still didn't want to think about it or uh, give it validity because like, oh, conspiracy theorists, this conspiracy theory, that. But 60 years later, the CIA came out and admitted that they were the one who, 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 you know, unalive JFK. Now, do you see what I'm saying? When those theories or those hearsay or she say come out, there is validity to it. Now, it might not be the way that you heard it, but there's validity to it. Do you see what I'm saying? So these movies, these TV shows, they're telling you something. Is, now they're telling you something is here. Not something is coming. Something is here. Have you seen Three Body Problem? Something is here. And it's working within the mist. Oh, check this out. Oh, 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 oh. The video, The Flash. I forgot to tell you. I forgot to tell you. The girl's name is Gracie, right? Remember the girl's name was Gracie? The reason why her name was Gracie is because Gracie, we've been seeing a lot of gray lately and seeing a lot of gray relates to seeing why we're seeing a lot of purples and reds and blues and different colors in the sky. Gracie, which is the gray zone, which is the 50 grays, 50 shades of gray. You see that? <laughs> you see that Gracie? And I showed the Silver Surfer earlier. That's a Silver Surfer. That's a Silver Surfer. Matter of fact, let's see what the Silver Surfer is. Hmm? Let's see who the Silver Surfer is all about. Why did why did I see the Silver Surfer today? Huh? There's been a lot of car accidents here in San Antonio. It's like intensified. Rob, I said this. I said this two years ago. I said this two years ago, and I also said this last year. And I said this, I and I also said this today. Noel says I post a relevant shit. Why do you? Why do? But still, you follow me. I don't understand that. I don't understand how you follow me. But you talk about. Hold on, y'all. That was really it. That was. Huh? Oh yeah, please block. Just indefinitely. 
Indefinitely. Wow. Wow. Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, wow, look. <laughs> Even Google, Google's, Google's got the, hold on. Look, Google's got the, Google's got the solar eclipse. They're ready to watch it. Look, they're ready to watch it, boy. They're ready to watch it. Um, all right, Silver Surfer. Let's look at the Silver Surfer. Okay, it says the Silver Surfer is a humanoid alien with metallic skin suit. Okay. Now, didn't that look like that? A humanoid. A humanoid... Doesn't that look like that? Doesn't that look like that humanoid skin uh, alien with metallic skin who can travel through space? Now, I don't know about you. The picture that I just pulled up looked like someone traveling through space because the sky, the ether is space. Y'all see that, right? Okay. Traveling through space. Oops. Right? Um, where's it at? Okay, there we go. With the aid of his of his surfboard like craft, originally a young huh? Okay, look. Uh, there we go. You see? You see? See? He represents again the gray zone. You see? This is all gray. He literally represents the gray zone and he's coming in Avengers. Because let me ask you a feel. Let me ask you a question. When you see gray, how do you feel? When you see gray, how do you feel? Hmm? Yeah, it makes you feel down, right? It makes you feel down. Look at the green. Look at look at him. Look at look. Yeah, he looks angry. He's coming for vengeance. That's why when it's gray outside, it's lightning. It's lightning, thundering, hell, hmm? tornadoes, tsunamis, hmm? cyclones, earthquakes, all gray zone, right? Silver surfer, silver surfer, 50 shades of gray, bringing all the elements with him. Y'all see that? That's why he, that's why he's angry. He is sent by the ancestors to clean up the planet. You see this? He is sent by the ancestors to clean up the planet. That's what he's doing. Let's see, all right? Let's see. A silver surfer is a humanoid alien with metallic skin who can travel through space with the aid of a surfboard like craft. Originally, a young astronomer named Norin Rad. You see? Now run rad, okay? Norin rad, okay? Nor ren, nor ren rad, okay? So they're running on the planet, all right? Look, rat on the planet. Zenla, which we are literally in the zenith. We are in the zen. We are literally in the zenith. The, pl the world is about to go to a transition right now. He saved the home world from the planet Devourer Galactus by serving his herald. And beauty and return with some portion of Galactus power cosmic. He acquired vast power and a nobody, a new body, and a surfboard like craft 
on which he could travel faster than light. Now known as a silver sulfur, he roamed the cosmos searching for planets for galactic to consume, right? Do you see that? So let me ask you a question, my people. Before the black, before the black, um, <laughs> before, let me ask you a question. Before you make a big entrance, what happens? What do you do? Hmm? No, 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 no. No. Before you make a big entrance, what usually happens? Like if you're on stage. Hmm? When you're on stage, before you make a big entrance, what what, what goes out first? What usually send out first? No, if you're if you're a one man show, intro, no, not intro, announcement, no, not announcement. Think think of the silver surfer. No, come on, yeah. What goes out first? Think about it. It looks cool when you see it. You're like, oh, I'm like oh, it's like eerie. You know what I'm saying? It looks e smoke, fog, fog, which is the gray zone. Y'all see that fog? That's why it's been foggy, and people have been having brain fog, right? It's the gray zone. It's the silver surfer, which is the smoky god. The smoky god. Because the smoky god sends out smoke first. Sends out fog. Sends out everything first. Letting it you know it's on its way. Since sound like, same like when you, be, you see your, your favorite celebrity on stage. They put out the fog first. And then your favorite celebrity walks through. You're like, oh. Oh, shit, look at Jay-Z, look at J. Cole, right? We about to do. Well, that's what we're about to do. That's what we're about to go look up and smile. We smiling already, baby, ear to ear. Hmm? Y'all see this? Y'all see that? The Silver Surfer. And you can't make this shit up. Because look. Look. And the eclipse is happening on 4-8. Bro, how can you make this shit up, bro? Huh? How can you make this shit up? The Eclipse is happening on 4-8, and he's featured on Fantastic Issue 48? Bro, right? Let me see. And then... American Book is in. Look. 32 pages. Didn't I just show you 38? Didn't I just show you... Um, hold on. Didn't I just show you Paramount is 38? Didn't I just show you Paramount is 38, my people? I just showed y'all 38 is Paramount, which is the movie that is literally put these people out. <laughs> that literally put these people out. It's Paramount, right? Wow. Right? And then I showed you how, you know, Cicada. Cicadas gives you 16. Cicadas give you 16. And then when you go to the cicadas, to the thing, right? Something else gave me 16 too. I don't remember what it was. But let me see. Let me see. Uh, Cicadas gives you 16. Cicadas give me 16, but something else gave me 16 in reference to um, uh, this right here. But um, let me see. But when you go to Cicadas, right? 16, you have 32 over here, right? 32, 6. Look at this. I'm talking about the Silver Surfer. So why does it say on average 32 pages? Why does it say 32 pages? And then look, oh my God, goddess. Silver. Surf, sulfur. Sulfur. So the sulfur is being dropped by the silver surfer. Wow. That's why that lady's shirt is green.
Oh my goodness, bro. You see why I fuck with y'all? You see why I fuck with y'all? So y'all learning things as I'm learning them, man. <sighs> and then again, right? 1938, which two threes together gives you an eight. Two threes together gives you an eight. And then you have the score. The score, the score of the game. It is one three, right? The score, that's one three. And then the movie Smile came out on the 30th, which is the other three, which is the 33, which is two gives you an eight. I was also born in August, which is the eighth month. 88, which is the three eights. I'm literally three eights. I'm literally the three eights, which is the three kings. I have three brothers. Well, I'm the third brother. It's three brothers. My goddess has 38 tatted on her before I even met her. 30, like three eights, the three kings. Yeah, it's crazy. It's, it's, it, and it goes on deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper. So much. Like I can go so much into the, into the, into this, but for what you feel me so yeah so it was 83 first now 84 okay 84 is coming up which is 12 which is truth the whole truth 12 has to do with the 12 chakras the 12 zodiacs the 12 months the 12 dna strands right um the 12 cranial nerves the 12 disciples okay mm, so much 12 uh 12 uh 12 hours in a day 12 hours in the night, right? It's so much. It's so much with it. So is the 13th month. Yes, so is the 13th month, which is which goes right back to Ophicius, which is the 13th constellation, which is nobody knows about Ophicius. Because Ophicius is the exit. Ophicius, Ophicius is the exit. That's God being baby. No time. Am I gonna go live tomorrow? Um, I don't see why not. I can. I'm when I come live. I'm selling. I'm selling pendants. So y'all better come ready. I'm gonna let y'all know that I'm selling pendants and 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 and, and pyramids tomorrow, y'all. Y'all better come ready. All right, bro. Do we need to be outside, bro? Please be outside. Be. What are you afraid for? You act like the sky is gonna fall on you. I don't say nothing, you know, but I'm gonna be outside. I'm gonna be outside. I'm not telling y'all nothing, you know. What do you, what do you, like, I gotta ask you, what are you afraid for? You're outside every single day. You're outside every single day without the news telling you to go outside or not. What do you, what's, what, what's, what's any different tomorrow? What's, how's tomorrow's any different? Do you see the world shaking? Do you see the world rumbling? Do you see things taking place? Please go do your thing. Now I'm gonna tell you the energy is going to be intense tomorrow because I can. I've been all day, all day today. I've been feeling this energy. It's been intense, so it's gonna it's gonna amplify. So I would say if you if you can avoid going out, avoid going out because the energy is gonna be intense. There's going to be NPCs out there that's going to be losing it. I'm gonna let y'all know that NPCs out there they're going to be losing it. So if you can stay away from them, stay away from it because. It's going to happen just like that at the switch. It's going to happen just like that. Just like when you turn off a light switch, when you turn off a light switch, it happens just like that. It doesn't, oh, you turn off the light switch and then the light takes 15, 20, 30 seconds to turn off. No, just like that at the flip, at the flip of a switch. Okay. Yeah. NPC is not player, player characters. So they're just they're just background people. They're just background noise in a sense. They're not real. All right, y'all. I gave y'all two lives today. Damn, boy. I gave y'all two lives today. And tomorrow again, I'm gonna come. I'm gonna come back and do a live with y'all, man. Y'all gonna come back and do a live with y'all. So yeah, um, yeah. NPC is non-player characters. They're just background noise. Just like in a movie, you have background actors. Just like in the movie, you have background actors. 
um, just like in a video game, you have background people that you never that you never uh, uh, interact with, or associate with. It's just like life. Life, you have background noise people that you will never get to talk to, that you will never get to associate with. They're just there to make you look good. They're just there to make the movie look good. They're just there to make the video game look good. But you will never associate or communicate with these people because you're not meant to. They're not meant. They're they're not for you. Okay. So yes. Yeah, they are extras. I love the content, bro. Keep it up. Appreciate love that gratitude. That's why I be. That's you know what I'm saying. I do it for y'all. I do it for y'all. But yeah, I've been, I've been, I've been, I've been up, man. I've been grinding the past couple of days, creating, and then I worked this this um, this uh, event, and now I'm calling it an end. Gratitude. Thank you. Oh, thank you, Rob. Appreciate love that. Thank you. Thank you for the for the uh, for the um, mustache hat. All right. All right, y'all. Thank you for tuning to my frequency. You only tune into my frequency because you resonate with the information that I have. Remember who you are. Remember who you are. Remember who you are. Beautiful, beautiful time to be alive. Go out there and ground yourself in that soil. You know what I'm saying? Go out there and ground yourself in that soil. Get that energy. It's going to... They, they already blocked the sun out. It's already cold. I can feel the atmosphere is cold. They already blocked the sun out. So... Um, if you can get some sun tomorrow, go get that sun. But other than that, y'all, be well. I'll be here tomorrow with y'all. We gonna we gonna be. What time is the eclipse? At two twenty two. Two twenty two. All right, we gonna go live. We gonna go live. Oh yeah, there's a lot of two twenty two. There's a lot of two two twos. I forgot to show you. And and I forgot to show y'all about all those twos and stuff like that, y'all. And then you can't even make this shit. So everything. So so uh, the palindrome year. And then you see all the twos when it comes to Smile. You see that, right? You see all the twos when it comes to the movie Smile. So, yeah. I... All I'm saying is be on the lookout. All I'm saying is be on the lookout. Who was that? B.A. Preach a little that B.A. I don't know. Thank you, pre BA. Gratitude to you, man. Thank you very much. Get your bars up. Gratitude. Thank you for that cap. No cap. All right, y'all. Um, I love y'all so much. Please be, please be safe. I'm gonna come on tomorrow. We're gonna kick it tomorrow. All right, we're gonna kick it tomorrow. Um, see what's up. You know, see if we get our superpowers or not. Finish it vibrating already. <laughs> Thank y'all for tuning to my frequency. I love y'all. Rest well. Protect yourself in the astral. Let's. What's up? Love y'all. Peace in. <laughs> Let's get this shit, y'all. Peace.